That's our today's special, and you don't want to miss out with well over 20,000 of those now ordered. We are staying in the kitchen, though, and I want to tempt you a little bit. Look at that. Look at those ribs. Oh, could you imagine having those right now for lunch or tonight for dinner? Oh, there's so much that you're gonna be able to do. These are, these are the things, to me, when I look at this table, it looks like kind of what we love about summer cooking, and that's the grilling, right? But you see that our table is set for fall, and what this means is that you don't have to stop at, you know, enjoying the grilled food just because summer turns into fall. You can continue to do it, and you can really expand the things that you cook when you have the right grill, and that's what we're gonna talk about in this hour, because Traeger brings us the Prairie 572 square inch wood fired grill and smoker. So it combines grilling, smoking, slow cooking and baking in one grill. I love, I love the ease of use of this. I love the versatility of this. So you're going to have great taste because this is wood fired. So the wood naturally enhances your food. The versatility in that all of the things that you can do, grill, smoke, bake, roast, braise, you can even barbecue. Um, the controls are easy to set and easy to use. And the fact that you've got that perfect consistency so that you, the food will be right every time. So for you, whether it is uh, ribs, whether it's your hot dogs, maybe it's your corn, maybe it's gonna be your steaks or your poultry, your chicken, Maybe it's your vegetables that you put on. Maybe you do decide to bake. We're gonna show you how to do that. And you're gonna do it all with your Traeger. Let me come on over here and give you a little tour of what you're getting first off. And then we're gonna be joined by the Diva Q herself. So this is the Traeger grill. And I've got two colors for you. You can choose it in black or we've got this pretty cinnamon red. It's gonna be your choice of which way you decide to go with it. We're gonna take you on a tour and so that you'll be confident with exactly how to use everything and exactly whether it's your grilling or anybody else in the household that you're going to really be confident every time with your grill. You're going to get the grill, you get the cover, I love that it comes with a cover. It's not a separate purchase. It comes and the cover was matched and designed specifically for your Traeger grill. That would be $59.99 on its own. You're going to get two bags of the wood pellets. And I love that. So it's gonna be hickory and oak. The bags of the pellets themselves would be another $59.99. You're also going to get the main grill grate, the extra cooking rack. You get two of the plug-in food thermometer probes. You're gonna get the fold down front prep shelf and the magnetic cutting board. You get all of this included. That retail that if purchased separately at retail is $200 more than our price is today. So you've got a great value. You've got it on flex pay. Um, so you're spreading out the payment. It's about five flex payments of $118. We'll ship it to you for free shipping and everything's included. Literally, you just add the food. You are ready to go right out of the box. Uh, if you want to use, now you can use FlexPay using any major credit card and get that home for $118. Now, if you use your HSN card, you can get what we call our 12 month VIP financing. So it's like having a 12 month flex pay. And if you spread the payment out over 12 months on your HSN, your Q card, or your Zulily card, you would be paying $49.16 per month to get this home, but you get it home uh, and you'll have it home in time or before Labor Day. So maybe you're gonna fire this up and that's gonna be the first time you use this for Labor Day cooking. And then you're gonna continue to cook with this all throughout the rest of this year and next year and on and on and on. Because once you start cooking with Traeger, you're not going to stop. Now we're joined by Danielle Bennett, better known as Diva Q herself. Danielle, it is so good to see you. Hi. Hi. Hello, everybody. How are you? I'm so excited you're here hanging out in my backyard. We've been cooking all day because I am so excited to show you what I got going on on the grill today. Today, I've got four grills full of goodness because I can't resist showing you all of this deliciousness. So, of course, you know, we've got that traditional beautiful roasted chicken. I have got some delicious hot dogs. Who doesn't love a good hot dog? Of course, right? The traditional classics. 
How about a bacon cheeseburger? Look how juicy that is. Look at that delicious goodness that's on the grill right now. So, you know, one of the cool things about a Traeger is if you notice right back here, I actually have whole strips of bacon grilling up on there. And of course, what is the one thing everybody loves these days? Take a look at this. Oh my gosh. Succulent. Look at that Mac Daddy tomahawk. So I've got to show you this. We all know that everybody is loving up on the tomahawks these days. So we've got this beautiful big piece of meat. I want to show you how gorgeous this delicious steak is. Look at that juiciness. Wow. Look at how delicious that is. Top to bottom, perfectly cooked. And we've got that delicious sear on the outside. This is why you want a Traeger because you know what? It's all about that taste. It's that wood fire taste that makes the biggest difference in a Traeger and everything else. And you know what? It's so easy to use. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Delicious. Look it was so good. It was perfect. I literally want to reach through the screen <laughs> and grab that. But that's the thing. Danielle is showing you what she put on her grill. Think about all the things you're going to put on your grill and share and, and, um, and prepare for you and your family. And what's great is that you get that consistency of cooking so you can cook like a pro every time. We're showing you from your roast to your corn on the cob. I mean, think about it. I mentioned steaks. We like to grill steaks at my house. Um, whatever it is you like, you do it on your Traeger. And that's why we want you to get it home. We want you to start using it. We want you to, I know you're going to fall in love with it. Um, and when you see how easy it is, and we're going to break it all down for you so that she'll be very confident. When you start cooking on your Traeger, you're, you won't want anything else. Just know free shipping. We've got it on flex pay. Um, and everything is perfectly done. And that's what I like about this. You don't have to worry about, is it gonna turn out this time? Because you do have that consistency of cooking every time. Danielle, we're coming back. We wanna see more food. We wanna see more <laughs> of what the Traeger can do. All right, so take a look at this. You know, for me, I am an actual pit master. I'm a world champion. And guess what grill I just happened to use, but you don't have to be a pit master to make delicious goodness. Look at these succulent, moist, incredible ribs. Look at this. Look at this rack of ribs. Look at that deliciousness. I'm telling you, that is golden mahogany. It is barbecue sexy. Oh my and this literally, I'm telling you right now, this is some happiness right here. Look at that beautifulness. Look at, I want to show you the bottom. I want to show you how delicious these are. Look at how perfectly cooked they are. And you know, one of the great things is, is that, you know, we've got the taste. We've got that versatility. And here is the thing. What about the fact is I popped these ribs on with some gorgeous rub. And all I did was I let them go for about six hours. Look at how succulent that meat wow. is. So we're talking about ease of use. You know, for me, it's not just about the fact that we get that beautiful, delicious flavor. And of course, that's my favorite thing. It's all about the flavor. It's about the fact that this was so easy. You know, last night, of course, you know, for today's airing, I trimmed up a brisket last night. This is the brisket right here. This was a 16 pound brisket. Now brisket is the make it or break it meat of all things barbecue. Mm -hmm. And this was as easy as it was. I put it on the grill last night with some rub. I wrapped it this morning when I got up. Oh. And I want you guys to oh see. Oh my gosh. Look at, look at that delicious, oh. beautiful, I'm telling you, this is the stuff of barbecue dreams, okay? And I want you guys to see how easy this meat is falling apart. Look at how delicious that, and look at that bark on the outside. Now we didn't have to babysit. We didn't have to feed the fire all night. All we had to do was before we went to bed, make sure that hopper was full of pellets. And I've got Texas style brisket in my backyard because of it. Oh so deliciously gosh. easy. How convenient is that? Yes. This I is what you're going for. You know, I, <laughs> Danielle, when you cut into that brisket, I was walking closer and closer. It looks amazing. <laughs> because I mean, it's true because to find really great tasting, great flavored barbecue, grilled anything, you probably know all the spots around where you live. Where I, Okay, I have to go to this side of town to get brisket. I have to go over yeah. here to get the ribs. I have to go over here to get the chicken or you just go to your backyard and go to your Traeger. I just want you to, to know, 
We do have two colors. They work exactly the same. Um, the black, a lot of you are calling in for the black already. The cinnamon is the more limited of the two. So if this is the one you want, just so you know, it's gonna be a cinnamon color. It's a cinnamon red on this front, but every other part of it, as you can see, is black on the inside. But you just have just a really nice, a nice um, highlight of this cinnamon color. You mentioned, Danielle, you mentioned making sure that the wood pellets were in with that brisket, making yep. sure that that was filled. Can you kind of walk yep. us through, and we're gonna show an animation of Absolutely. how you set this up. Mm -hmm. So one of the great things about a Traeger grill is its ease of use, right? So for me, it's really easy. You plug it in, you make sure the hopper is filled with that all natural hardwood pellet. And that's key. Traeger pellets are the best out there. You set the temperature low and slow, hot and fast. You know what? It's all about what you personally decide. Remember, that's that versatility part. And then the auger does all the great work for you. It actually takes the pellets right to the hot pot, enveloping the entire chamber with that delicious wood fire goodness. Now that is literally the easiest thing ever. You can put everything on your Traeger, burgers, big pieces of meat. And by the way, we're going to show you some really great baked goods as well, but that's it. Now, the other part is for me, ease of use on cleanup because if you notice it is literally all the drippings go into a little pot on the side and that's it simple easy cleanup that's, perfect that's it i mean literally that's, that's it. it that's it this is that's this it. this is where the wood pellets go and you're and we're giving you two bags of them that would be an, a, an extra yes. 60 dollar uh, value right there so you pop those in here this is here's the plug-in and it's just a simple three prong plug-in You've got That's it, regular. your temperature gauge. I like that it's a it's a knob. I mean, I like computers <laughs> like the next person, but if it's a knob, I mean, I can totally do the knob, right? You can do that as well. And <laughs> that's why you get consistent cooking because you're never wondering how hot the grill is. That's what I always hear, Danielle, from from just, you know, not the pro, not the, the, the grill masters or the pit masters. I hear from just the average grillers where the grill's too hot, I don't wanna burn the food, or the grill wasn't hot enough and everything kind of didn't really cook well. This is that consistency in the palm of your hand. It's the consistency from side to side. You set the temperature to what you want, and this is that lovely bucket on the side that gathers all of that lovely grease, and it's super easy to clean up. You can buy liners for it, super easy. Now, one of the great things about that, this just hangs on the side. And remember, we were just talking about how easy it is to utilize this grill. So that little bucket, you know, it captures all the grease. But another thing I love, did you see those two beautiful probes that come with the grill? For me, this goes right back again to how easy can it be and that convenience factor. So these probes actually can go in those really big, large cuts of meat. Remember, we want to make this as easy as possible to get that beautiful wood-fired flavor. So all we do is overnight, we'll put a probe in the meat just like that. And then all you have to do is you just plug that into the probe right here on the grill. And then you don't even have to open the lid. You plug it in oh. right there. And then you don't even have to open the lid because we don't want to lose any of that heat like any other grill. This is what separates, you know, once again, that convenience factor. The hopper has been filled with that beautiful all natural wood pellet. And then of course, those pros make your life even easier. Are you ready for this? Yes. We talked about, you know, coming to your backyard. Mm -hmm. We all want to come to the backyard because we don't want to go out to a barbecue restaurant. I want to show you something that's truly spectacular. Take a look at this pork butt. This pork butt last night went on, okay? I am literally going to shred the meat oh right off of this, okay? Oh, my god! And gosh. then watch this. You know that these pork butts, they're big. They've got a big bone in it. Look at oh. the bone that just came out of that. No resistance. And the best part is, look at that succulent, delicious barbecue meat. Oh, my goodness. Super easy. All we did. Look, look at how deliciously beautiful. I love pork, by the way. I love me a pulled pork sandwich. So, of course, you grab yourself a beautiful pork. You grab yourself chunks of this delicious. Look at that delicious color on the outside, that mahogany barbecue goodness, right? Wow. And this is, of course, you know, when we go, you were just talking about the restaurants we go to. This is the thing, right? This is what people go out for. And we've got this in our backyard. I got a little bit of Texas spice because, you know, we're bringing Texas to your backyard, basically. <laughs> got a little bit of barbecue sauce going on there. Oh, we've got some goodness. beautiful 
delicious succulent barbecue. And now who <laughs> would want this sandwich? Wood-fired kissed pulled pork. All we did was we put it on last night before we went to bed. We put the probe in. We made sure the hopper was filled with those all natural hardwood pellets. I ran hickory all night in mine. And look at the sandwich. I don't wow. have to go out anywhere. It's, wow. it's in my backyard. It's, it's right there in your backyard. It's right there when you <laughs> want it. And that's the thing. Uh, and it's going to be right every time because you control, you can have control over the heat of the grill. If you want to cook it low and slow, if you want it to cook for eight hours, for 10 hours, for 12 hours, you've got that um, that handle on that, which is fantastic. The probe that DivaQ was talking about, you're getting two of them. So there's, like I said, there's nothing extra. You just add the food, you get the probes, you're going to get two bags of the wood pellets. You're going to get the oak and the hickory. And if you like other flavors, you can definitely go out and find those as well. But you're going to get those bags right off the top, and those come included. This would be another $60 purchase if you had to do this separately. But you don't. When you order it today, you're getting everything included. Um, and that's one of the things I love about our value is that these are the things that you would want with your grill that you're not having to buy a la carte. The, um, the I said a $60 value, actually the, the um, pellets are a, almost a $38 value. The cover is about a $60 value. And that cover was specially designed for your Traeger. So on those days, on those afternoons or evenings when you're not cooking on the grill, you keep it covered and it keeps it protected and it was specially made for your grill. The question is, which one are you getting? Because you will get these home in time for Labor Day cooking. And much after that. Are you gonna get it in black or are you gonna get it in the cinnamon? What I love is that when you have a really great grill that you can feel confident in every time, it means that you're not just doing your burgers and your hot dogs, you're doing, you're not just doing your ribs. Think about how different your Thanksgiving meal could be this year. Instead of just doing a turkey like everybody else, if you wanted to um, do something different on your grill, you could do that. If you wanted to make your, just a regular Thursday night meal, something amazing on your Traeger grill, you could do that because you've got it in hand. You're paying $200 less than if you were to purchase everything separately at retail. As a matter of fact, our regular price here at HSN is $110 more than what you see our sale price is today. So free shipping on FlexPay, you get everything. I want you to go for it. Danielle, I want to come back because, okay, so I already want the pulled pork sandwich. You've already tempted me with the brisket. I can't wait to see more. <laughs> okay, so we were just talking about, I love the fact you brought up Thanksgiving already. Yes. <laughs> because let me tell you, a Traeger grill is not only a game changer every day for taste and versatility, you know, that ease of use. I mean, come on, how much more convenient can it get, right? We didn't have to maintain the firebox all night. You know, we filled the pellets. Let me show you what I consider kind of like my roasting and my holiday grill, basically. Um, oh. How about this? Oh. Okay, so this is what I consider. This is a double-smoked apricot ham, oh a my. whole ham. What I did was I scored it, and then I shellacked it with some apricot preserves. Oh and, of course, look at how beautiful that is. And then... You know, because the grill is really that versatile. Um, on the upper rack, remember we talked about the size, right, of the grill. So the upper rack, I've got some double stuffed baked potatoes. I've got some beans. I've got my, I, I always fill up the little leftover bits with peppers because I eat them all week and, you know, frittatas and omelets and everything else. I've got some creamy, dreamy mac and cheese up there. And then we've got the mac daddy roast of them all. This is the prime rib. Oh, okay? Now, this is a boneless prime rib. I'm going to take this out very carefully, okay? Now, I want you guys to come in close. I want you to look at the surface of this prime rib. This is that wood fire deliciousness all the way around this beautiful roast. That literally is giving this roast more flavor than you've ever had before. So we're talking about our Thanksgiving meals. And take a look at this. I want you guys to see how incredibly beautiful this roast is on the inside. Now we like our meat rare at our house. I don't know about you, mm -hmm. but we are a rare family. And I know, I know there's other people out there that like it, you know, a little more well done, but we are definitely in the rare category here. Take a look at this. Wow. Look at how juicy that is. Look at how delicious that meat is. 
okay? And we've got that beautiful succulent crust on the outside. This roast always makes me so excited. Um, and, and I'm telling you right now, I can never resist this roast. I'm telling you, I'm going in. I'm going in today because we're at my house and I get yeah. to eat the, you know, see, I'm quality control here. Quality control. <laughs> That's right. Well, you have to taste it before you serve it to anybody else, right? And uh, I'm with you. I'm with you. I like it rare. I like it a little bit more on the hot pink side, which is what you were seeing there. But when yep. you are cooking it, whether it's, and that's the thing, you can control that. It's not going to be a guessing game when you're cooking it yeah. because you're keeping, because you can control the heat of the grill. And I'll tell you, if you, maybe you're not the one who grills. Maybe it's, it's your partner in your household who grills. And so you always, there's always a lot of frustration around the grill. It's too hot. It's not hot <laughs> enough. Or these were cooked well. This side of the grill cooked well, but this side didn't. I hear that all the time. Um, when you have something that's more consistent, you're not going to have that kind of frustration because when you're, you can hear from Danielle, there's a love of cooking. There shouldn't be frustration around cooking. If you can do it easier, <laughs> you do it. You can do, you can smoke. You can, from 180 degrees all the way over um, that you can see here, 375, you can even pop it on high. These are the probes where you pop those in as Danielle was showing that to us. And it's as simple as that. It's gonna give you your temperature readout in Fahrenheit right here along the top. Obviously we don't have ours plugged in so you don't see a temperature readout there, but it will be. And it's as simple as that. What do you wanna eat? What do you want to cook? You pop it on your Traeger. By far, black is the more popular of the two. A lot of you are calling in for black, but we only have a couple hundred left now in the cinnamon. So either way, when you lift up your grill and Danielle, not only does the food yep. look good, there's so <laughs> much food that you've got on your grill. So I can literally do the entire meal in yeah. one sitting. Yeah, this is the versatility of the size of this grill and also the front shelf. I'm a big fan of this front shelf, by the way. No joke, okay? As you can see, I've been cutting things on it. I've got a cut, the cutting board on there. I've got plates on there. I'm a huge fan of the front shelf on this grill, too. Um, you know, this is an entire, more than an entire meal on this grill right now um, with, with the side dishes, with all that goodness. And, of course, you know, I, my peppers are actually for meal prep this week, right? And, of course, this is more than enough for a standard family. Now, we're talking about families. We're talking about, you were talking about, you know, who actually uses the grill at the house. Mm -hmm. You know, one of the good things about a Traeger grill is that they're, you know, sometimes people get a little intimidated by running other kind of fuel sources. My kids are on these grills. Seriously. Oh, wow. yeah. um, they're you know, 15 and 17, and they're here, and they love their Traegers as well. And we also have seniors that run them, too, because, you know, the fear factors are gone, right? They don't yeah. have to work as hard to maintain the temperature. And also going to show you this one are you ready for this okay yes okay are you ready yes how about oh, baking wow. now i just turned this one off because our pizza just got done how about an entire pizza done on the grill oh my gosh now i want to show you something on the bottom okay you can see the great marks but look at that golden crust on the bottom yes okay now this is once again another reason to get a traeger grill because instead of also having a you know pizza oven look at i've got cookie pies on here i've got a cherry pie on here i did a cornbread just for a just because i could you know and all of these things combined you know this is once again that ease of use and also I, i'm telling you that versatility i didn't have to have a pizza oven plus a traeger mm -hmm. i just have a traeger mm -hmm. and come on who doesn't love a cheesy, oh, oh my delicious, goodness. golden slice of pizza? <laughs> oh my god! I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm getting full here, but I'm not complaining. No. I'm just saying. <laughs> oh my god! Pizza oven, golden crust. And remember, this was just a regular, you know, this is a regular frozen pizza. The kids come home from school ready to throw a pizza on the Traeger. Yeah. They can do the homemade ones if they want. Um, so it's not just about the big meats. You know, you've seen. I've got quite a few vegetables on here. So it's not just for meat eaters. You know, we love doing whole heads of cauliflower, sweet potatoes, asparagus. Mm -hmm. You know, we love putting our fish on the grill. We love all of those things because, you know, you can't beat that wood-fired taste. 
And that's what's adding that delicious goodness to everything you put on a Traeger every single time. Yes, it does. And it, and it will for you. And we're, and we're showing you all these different types of foods and giving you ideas um, so that you can really feel confident with whatever you want to grill and whatever you want to pull on, put on your Traeger. And I'm glad that Danielle mentioned sometimes there is a fear factor, and I understand it, when it comes to grilling, you know, um, and b because you don't have to deal with charcoal or with, um, you know, the tanks or, or the, you know, the tanks of gas or the open flames and things like that, it does take that fear factor or that intimidation factor, I'll say it like that, maybe not yeah. fear, but just a little bit yeah. of, I feel a little bit intimidated. Is this going to be overpowering a little bit for me? It's not. You see how easy it is. You plug it in, you put your wood pellets in, and we're getting you started with two 20-pound bags of wood pellets. One hickory, one oak. You can, you know, d determine what flavors you like. If you have other flavors that you like, you put the wood pellets in. This is already, you know, you would plug it in, and then you determine your temperature, and you're done. You've got an area to plug in the probes. You're getting two probes that come along with it. Um, and you let it do the cooking. What I like is that the cleanup is so simple because the fat and the oils and things like that, they will fall here and then you just dispose of them. And maybe you have other things that you wanna do with those, the, with those uh, fats and oils, but you dispose of them in that way. It's as easy as that. It is as easy as we show. I want you to get it home and try it out because you'll, be so proud of what you can put on your table for your family and friends and for yourself when you get this home and you try it. Remember, use any major credit card and you've got it on FlexPay. You see our sale price is fantastic, um, especially compared to our regular HSN price and compared to retail. Compared to retail, we're $200 less. It's not always gonna be the sale price, but it is today. And you order now, you will get it um, before Labor Day, which is coming up on September, 6th, I think. <laughs> September 6th. It's going to be here before you know it. You'll have this before you know it and you can start shopping. You're getting your Traeger in either black or, or cinnamon. You're going to get your cover that comes included. You're going to get the wood, the two, pell uh, two 20 pound bags of the wood pellets. You're also going to get your magnetic cutting board, which is fantastic. You're going to get the probes. You get everything that you need and you get it for $118 in free shipping. This is how it would all break out if you were to buy everything separately, but today you don't have to. We're showing you a color that's already sold out there. That shows you how popular and how fast these go. So we wanted to do it now so that you have it in time before Labor Day weekend and you can get your keep your grilling going. Remember, if you use your HSN card, you can get 12-month VIP financing where it's where it, whether it's your HSN card, your Q card, or your Zulily card, and you can spread out that payment. And it's about $49 a month, like having a 12-month flex pay. Danielle, we're going to come back to you, and we're showing some imagery of the Traeger, and just once again some ideas of what you're going to oh, cook yeah. here. Yeah, I love all of these things. Um, you know, when it comes to the grill, it's corn on the cob, it's prime rib, it's everything. And we talked about fish on the grill. How many times have people cooked fish on the grill and it's dried out? I got to show you my salmon today. I can't wait to show it to you because I love what happens to fish on the grill because fish on the grill tends to dry out. I love cooking salmon and trout and cod and, and halibut and all those things but I hate dried out fish. So take a look at this. This is an entire big slab of thick cut, like super thick cut salmon. So I want you guys to see how incredibly moist it is. Oh. Look at that. That is a delicious, moist piece of salmon. Beautifully smoked. And look at this. It is just so gorgeous. I love the fact that fish on the grill stays that moist. I mean, really, if we're trying to eat a little healthier, some of us might have put on a few pounds. We <laughs> might be working on this. You know, I'm just saying, real life. Yeah. You know, cooking delicious, healthy fish on the grill. Yeah. That stays lovely and moist. It's brilliant. And yes. once again, it comes back to that wood-fired flavor because that was really easy. I popped it on the grill. Super simple. Right next to it. Look at my little veggies today. I love these little veggies. These are delicious. They're great for meal prep. They're great snacks. You know, who doesn't love great veggies? And, and yummy you goodness. Yeah. 
Oh, so good. And there's cool. and there's plenty of room on the grill for all of that, as you see. And what I like, too, you might live in a household where there are different kinds of eaters. You might have meat eaters or only pescatarians or, you know, maybe it's the mm -hmm. kids that only want burgers and dogs and those kinds of things. Do you see how you can do all of that on the same grill? <laughs> so if you are the one doing the cooking, you're not pulling your hair out trying to appease everybody in the household with all of the, you know, with all the cooking, you just do it on your Traeger. We're showing you our table. Like I said, that could be your meal now. That could be your meal in <laughs> October. You know what I mean? Um, because we have our table set up for the fall, but when it comes to grilled food, we it's something that we all love, but maybe we don't eat it as often as we would like. When it's as easy as the Traeger, when I don't have to worry about, oh, do I have gas in the tank? Or do I have charcoal? Or do I have, you know, um, or, or is the person who does the grilling, you know, you know, in the mood to grill? You don't have to worry about that. When you have your Traeger, they make it really easy. Remember, your wood pellets go in here. You plug it in. You turn on your temperature. You decide low and slow if you want to cook it a little bit faster, you can do that. Um, you've got 572 square inches of space. You've got the rack along the top. You've got all of this space here. And you saw how big of cuts of meat and prime rib and brisket um, and pork butt and everything else that Danielle was cooking there. And then you have your lift up um, tray right here that cuts. I won't lift that all the way up yet just because I want you to see just the inside of here. You've got that included. This is where all of the fat comes. So it makes it easy to, and when it's time to dispose of that, look, you just take the, the pail and you dispose of it. As simple as that. The question is, do you want it in black or do you want it in red? Because you're having, <laughs> you're going to get it before Labor Day. So think about all of the amazing food that you can eat starting Labor Day and beyond. Danielle, I know that we, you know, we've been talking about our Traeger for about half an hour. Some of you have yeah. already jumped in to get yours. For those of you who are just joining us, welcome in. You're watching HSN. Uh, meet Danielle Bennett, Diva Q. She is a grill master. She's a pit master. She knows her business. And Danielle, I know you could and have cooked and grilled on all different types of grills, but this is yep. one that you really love. Um, I actually have owned 65 grills in the past, <laughs> and I currently own 22 grills. And every single one of them is a Traeger now. Wow. <laughs> so there you go. Yeah, I'm an actual certified barbecue expert. And uh, one of the things is, is that when you combine all the things, the convenience, the taste, um, the everyday usage, you know, my, my whole thing is, is that I want to make every day more delicious. I really do. And that's how I do it. I use it at Traeger Grill every day, whether it's breakfast. We cook frittatas on the grill. We cook bacon on the grill. We cook our lunches on the grill. Today, we had tri-tip sandwiches. You guys can go over to my Instagram. You can see the tri-tip sandwiches I made for lunch today. <laughs> I cook every single day, whether it's a paella or even a pot of chili or even something like this. I love mac and cheese. I mean, you know. I feel rather healthy. I just had a bite of salmon. So now let's go to the deck. Let's let's go to the decadent side of life. Okay, so this is really hot. So I've got my little cloth here. Okay. So you see I've got a little cast iron pan here. Now here's the thing. You can have mac and cheese, or how about you have wood-fired kissed mac and cheese? Oh. And we take the flavor up a whole other level. So this is another way to add in more flavor because flavor, it's hot, it's delicious, it's creamy, and you got that little kiss of wood-fired flavor. This is spectacularly good. And one of the things is, is that I just popped that up on the top shelf. Super simple, right? Because my main area here at the bottom was like, I had a nine and a half pound, you know, prime rib roast. This is almost seven pounds, this ham. I've got tons of food on here and look at the ease of use. And of course, once again, we're going back to that delicious prime rib. Look at how succulent and moist it is with that beautiful mahogany exterior. And that is just one of the easiest things in the world to do on a Traeger grill. Yes. So remember, that's also an investment piece of meat. I don't like to mess up my meat mm -hmm. ever, right? So between the probes that we've got and the delicious grill, this is a key thing for me. It is all about the goodness. It is all about making sure that we get the great results every single time consistently with Traeger grills. You know what, Danielle, it's so funny that you say that about um, sometimes you do, you, we pay a lot for certain cuts of yeah. meat and you want it to be right. I can think of, I can remember a time, 
uh, where we had some friends over and my hubby let the friend do the grilling and I had bought uh -oh. the steaks. <laughs> oh my gosh, it was like eating shoe leather by the time he, cause he didn't know the grill and he didn't know where the hot spots were and the yeah. cold spots and then they all burned. And I was thinking, do you know how much I paid for those steaks? Um, so sometimes, yes, you, you do wanna be, you do want to have that consistency and you want to have that confidence level of knowing that it's going to be right and knowing that when I cook this it's, and I serve it to my family, I'm not going to cross my fingers and hope it turned out well because you've got that consistency of heat and that's what we're talking about. Most grills, when you're cooking with charcoal or when you're cooking with gas and you don't really know the temperature of the grill and you can't you can't keep the temperature without babysitting it. You're gonna love the fact that this is just a, an easy knob that you turn and you can go from smoke, you can go from the lowest of the low and then you can even cook on high. And literally, it's just a turn of the knob. I said earlier, I like computers as much as the next girl, but uh, it makes it even better if I can just turn the knob and I'm there. Talk to us again about the probe plugins that we see here and yeah. why that's important. You know, when it comes to, remember, we were just talking about those delicious pieces of meat. Um, you know, a really good quality brisket these days is about $145. Wow. And remember, we want a delicious brisket. Now, brisket is a make it or break it type of meat. So one of the things that we did last night, actually, and this is the reality of how I cook, you know, for, for myself and my family, is, you know, I seasoned up my brisket completely. I took the probe. I put the probe in the thickest part of the brisket. And all I had to do at that point was actually just put it on over here, right underneath, because we're working low and slow today, in one of the two pro holders. And at that point, you know, what we're doing then is we're allowing ourselves to check the temperature of the meat without having to open the lid. And then we ran it all night. When I got up this morning, I wrapped it, and away we went for today. And this makes it consistently delicious every single time. And you don't just get one, you get two of them, which is awesome. So if you run in a couple of big pieces of meat overnight, you're never gonna mess them up. And also remember, the Traeger Grills community is massive. We have millions of people that have Traegers. There are entirely incredible communities. It's called the Traeger Hood. And we <laughs> love everybody because everybody is so, uh, it's, it's such a wonderful community. So not only do you get the grill, you get a whole community to come with it. Yes. Um, and we've got thousands of recipes on the Traeger Girls website. You, of course, you mentioned already, you know, it comes with the two bags of pellets, but of course you've got other flavors and varieties. You can go on the Traeger Girls website and find your local dealers for those if you need them. But that community that comes with the Traeger Grills is amazing because we love to share what we cook. You know, we bring together people through great wood fired tasting food. That's what we do. And I think, uh, you know, more people that share food, the better, right? Can yes. we go look at all this goodness. And we're bringing people together through delicious barbecue. For sure. I mean, and, and this is an easy way to do it. And so I'm glad that we have this for you now. And as you're watching, as you're looking at the food, I hope you're getting hungry and salivating and thinking, I wish I had that for lunch right now. Imagine when you have your Traeger, you will be able to have that. And it won't be that having a really amazing amazing uh, grilled meal won't just be every now and then. It can be whenever you want it. It can be once a week. It could be um, every day, like you heard Diva Q say, every day she has her Traeger on and cooking. And it's, 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 it's a very simple process. We're gonna break down, and Danielle, we're gonna show this animation again about how it works for, for folks who just tuned in and maybe missed seeing a little bit earlier. Yeah, I love this animation. So basically it starts off by you plug the unit in and it's super easy. You plug it in and then you fill the hopper with the 100% all natural hardwood pellets. Now, once you do that, the auger actually does all the work for you. You don't have to babysit it. Literally, the auger will deliver as many pellets as it needs to the hot pot. Yeah, it depends on what temperature you set it to. Low and slow, hot and fast, or somewhere in the meantime. You load your grill up and that delicious wood-fired air, you know, travels through the entire chamber, enveloping your food with all that goodness. And then, of course, once again, that benefit of all the grease and all that stuff going out the side to that wonderful bucket, making the ease of cleanup just awesome. I love it. It's just a real great way to barbecue and grill every single day. And not only barbecue and grill, but bake, roast, smoke, and uh, you know what? Do some goodness on the grill every day.
Yes. Look, and and I, I, I again, we've got a sale price that really just can't be beat. Um, we have an offer for you with everything that you get that once again can't be beat because there's nothing a la carte that you're picking up. You get everything that you need. You add the food. <laughs> That's all you have to do is add the food. <laughs> and everything that you're getting uh, in this configuration is coming right along with you. So when you get it home, it is ready to go. It is ready to grill. Think about the first meal that you're going to make on this because it's going to come to you before Labor Day weekend, which is coming up. It's hard to believe more than half <laughs> the year is already gone. Um, oh. But we are moving into, um, I call Danielle, I always call the second half of the year, I call it eating season. Some people call it cooking <laughs> season. I call it eating season because that's when we're, we're maybe eating, you know, some of our favorite foods. We're eating our um, briskets. We're eating our steaks. We're eating our pork chops and those kinds of things. Why not have it grilled with that wood fired flavor, which is what this is giving you. So it's not going to taste like charcoal. It's not going to taste like, you know, um, where you have to add the flavor in. You season it how you want it, but there's something about that wood fired that wood fired grill that really imparts flavor that it's hard to get in other places. Do you agree? Absolutely. You know, one of the great things is, is that, you know, that wood fired kiss goodness is great on the meats. It's great on the veggies. You know what? Let me show you something else though. How about the last time you baked a pie on your grill? You know, <laughs> baking a pie on the grill makes my heart happy. Okay. You were talking about this tis the eating season. Well, remember all the farmers markets now are full yes. ah, of all that goodness. Now, of course, this is a pie. Now I want you to see, Oh my gosh. You're coming close. I want you to see how flaky this crust is. Oh. That is some serious flakiness, people. Look at that flakiness. And the reason is that convection style heat creates all of that wonderful layers. And so this was done on the griddle. Now, I don't know about you, I'm here in Central Florida. It's a hundred plus degrees out here today with all the grills going, mm -hmm. you know, and I'm still baking pies and cookies and the kids are loving it. And then of course, this is going into the Thanksgiving season. Yes. Also, as you refer to it as the eating season. <laughs> We've got pecan pies or pecan, depending on what state you're in. You've got your pumpkin pies. You've got all this goodness. And it's just ever so lightly wood-fired kissed. And that is a huge bonus to me. I mean, I'm telling you, not only are you going to have amazing turkeys off there, you're going to have some smoked sweet potato casserole, I bet you. Oh. And, of course, delicious, delicious pie. Oh my God. I just wish I were there. Don't you, don't you wish you were right there with all of that food and a fork? That's all you need. And that's the thing. It, when you cook, I, I know that I, I, I don't call myself a really great cook, but I do my best. And I try to, um, you know, when I cook, I really want my family to like it. And when they do, it makes me feel good. When I've cooked something and I did it right and it came out right and nothing was burned and it was exactly the way it was supposed to be. It makes me feel good as the person who did it. If you're the, the one who cooks for your family and you feel a sense of joy when they're, when the dinner table is silent because everybody's so busy putting the food in their mouth, you know it's good. When you hear the, mm, that was great. It does, it does make you feel good. If you like to cook because that's your hobby but you want to be able to do it in a way that's easy to do and easy to clean up afterwards. You want to be able to do it that when you decide to invest in a quality cut of meat, you know it's going to be cooked consistently and it's going to be cooked well the way you intended, then I want you to call in for your Traeger or you can shop on hsn.com to pick it up. The item number is 752 953, that's the number to get it home. Your only choice is do you want it in black or do you want it in the cinnamon color? We have far fewer in the cinnamon than we do of the black. We did bring in more in the black. Um, if, we, if you want it in cinnamon, only a couple hundred remaining. The cinnamon is going to be cinnamon right here on the lid only. The rest of it is black. Um, just so you know, and you won't be surprised when you get it home, you're going to get everything you need right off the bat. You're going to get 
get the tw two 20 pound bags of wood pellets to get you started. You're gonna get the oak as well as that hickory. This also is a cutting board that's also magnetic. And it's magnetic so that when you have it on that lift up shelf that Diva Q was talking about, it doesn't move. So you can easily cut with that. I think that's great. It even says Traeger that's embedded right there on the cutting board. You're gonna get two probes. We were talking about the importance of the probes so that a, you can know the internal temperature of the meat, and so you know if you like it rare or medium or more on the well side, it's going to give you that, but it also means you don't have to keep opening up the lid of the grill and changing the temperature of the grill on the inside every time you do that. You get everything that you need. You're gonna get an owner's manual, and like I say, you get everything, you add the food. We gave you the best price that we could possibly give. It's $200 off of retail. You've got free shipping, so all of this is coming to you and you're not paying for shipping. And you now have the opportunity to have that wood fired, grilled, smoked, baked, roasted, braised, barbecued meal any time you want it. And I love, Danielle, as you said, for breakfast, lunch, dinner, <laughs> dessert, movie night, snacks, whatever it is, you can do it on your Traeger. Yeah, for me, it is literally that versatility. Um, remember that pulled pork we had back here? Make some really good nachos. <laughs> so uh, let me tell you, if you <laughs> I'm just speaking from experience here. You said movie <laughs> night, and that was the first thing. I'm like, oh, we love us a nacho night. We really do. <laughs> because all that pulled pork goes so well in nachos. You know, and coming back to that, uh, that holiday grill, because as you mentioned, we're going into Thanksgiving. I mean, come on. It's so easy to make a delicious glazed ham and have that wood fire goodness on there. Like, look at this beautiful ham that I did, and it's gorgeous and succulent, and I'm gonna chunk off a beautiful piece here so you guys can see. Um, I love that beautiful wood fire goodness on the outside. We've got the glaze on there today. I mean, this is the ham of your holiday dreams, mm -hmm. I'm telling you, because we're coming up to Thanksgiving, and, and it's like you said, you know, we're gonna bring together our families, and of course, you know, the kids are back to school typically in a lot of states right now, We've got lots of things that we need to work on. Mm -hmm. You know, ham and eggs the next day is a good thing on the grill and a frittata. I like, I like that. Ham and yeah, eggs for breakfast. You got the pulled pork nachos. I'm with you. You can pop those into some enchiladas as well. There's so <laughs> much you can do. And because you can put so much food on the grill, this is the thing. You can cook on, let's say, let's just choose a date. You cook on Sunday and you have enough food to, for the rest of the week. So even if you just grill one time a week because you're going to spread out the, um, the remainder of the food and you're gonna use it for this meal and then you're gonna use the rest for, I call it remix. You're gonna remix the ham the next day. You're gonna remix the pulled pork the next day. You can cook one time for an entire family and have enough food for the week. I love the space you've got here. 572 square inches on this grill, the lid stays closed so it keeps the temperature. You dial it up or dial it down. We always hear that low and slow is gonna give you, depending on what you're cooking, but it's gonna give you that succulent, juicy flavor and now it makes it easier for you to do it without having to baby it. Um, and I even love, Danielle, as you were mentioning, there is an entire community of folks who who cook and grill on their Traeger and share recipes. So literally, you're not alone when you get this home. And it really does open up a wide span of what am I going to eat today? You know, I love that community so much. It's near and dear to my heart, the Traeger hood. Um, and, you know, I get inspiration from all those wonderful people. Take a look at this. We were talking about the meals that we're going to be making over the course of, you know, our lifetime. But take a look at this beautiful chicken. I want to, okay, you ready for this? Yes. You got to come in close. I'm going to show you. This is a fully cooked chicken. I want you to see how juicy this chicken still wow. is. Okay. That is literally an incredible roast chicken. Okay. That is moist and delicious. And remember, it's been sitting here now for, well, we've been on for almost 45 minutes. Yes. Look at that meat. Look at how deliciously moist that meat is. Oh my gosh. And this is the whole point. This delicious, gorgeous roast chicken. It's got the crispy, thin skin on the outside. So we've got that delicious texture. We've got, look at how thin that skin is because it's a lovely roasted, beautiful chicken skin. Our lovely meat that's all succulent and moist. And who doesn't love a good Sunday roast chicken? Yeah. You were talking about the fact that you can cook once a week. And then, you know what? 
you're talking about the enchiladas. Well, you know what we do with roast chicken? Enchiladas. Tacos. Yeah. <laughs> we do everything with it. And remember, it's all about the taste. I don't want to go for just a regular, you know, regular cooked roast chicken. I'm going to go for that wood-fired flavor, kissed with hickory, kissed with oak, kissed with any of our delicious 100% all-natural hardwood flavors. And that, to me, is going to be the biggest difference. You know, we put the grill on, we put the chicken on, seasoned, throw some veggies on there, turn the grill to the temperature we like, and we roast the chicken. It's really that easy. We didn't have to babysit it. We didn't have to monitor it. It's super easy. Yes. And you... And and you get that consistency every time. You can literally, you can cook like a pro every time. You can get it down pat so that you know that when you buy that maybe more expensive cut of meat and you put it on your Traeger, you know it's gonna turn out and you're not like, you know, and I've done this many times, cross my fingers and hope it worked because I don't have any <laughs> other option for dinner. I just, I, it has to be right. And that's what the Traeger gives you. It gives you that confidence and that ease of use. So you don't have to be an expert expert on the grill in order to, to in order to serve amazing flavored and quality food every time. Now, I know that our clock is quickly running out, but if you've been watching even for a few minutes and you're saying, you know, I really do want one and I and I, I like the price. It's a, it's a really great value. And it is. We took $200 off of retail and you're getting everything. It's not just the grill that you're getting. You're getting that customized cover that would be another $60. And you're going to need that for the days that you're not using it. Cover your Traeger and really keep it protected. You're getting the two 20-pound bags of the wood pellets. One oak, one hickory. That's almost 38 extra dollars that you're not spending. You're getting that shelf and that, I love that shelf that folds down. So it's that prep, that front prep chef, uh, shelf that would be another $60 if you were gonna have to buy it separately. Um, you're going to get the probes and you get two of them. That's another about $32 that you're not spending. So like I say, there's nothing a la carte. There's nothing that it's, well, I got the grill, now I need X, Y, Z. No. Now you just add the food. It's really that simple. You're even gonna get this cutting board that's magnetic. So it actually will hold onto that fold up prep shelf. So that's coming included as well. This is everything that you would want for grilling, for smoking, for slow cooking, for braising, for barbecuing, and you do it really easy. And it takes out any intimidation factor that you might have surrounding cooking, and or I should say surrounding grilling. And I know as we're, sh we're showing burgers and, and hot dogs, but Danielle, I am so impressed with all of the food <laughs> from literally from every meal that you've shared with us in, the, in this hour thus far. I gotta tell you, this girl makes me look darn good. <laughs> it really does. Because here's the thing, I'll take a little bit of credit, but I will tell you this, it's all about the fact that this grill gives you the great taste. It's that ease of use, it's that versatility. I gotta take you back to one more rack of ribs. I have to show you the ribs. I love ribs so much. You know, we've got these wow. slow and low, beautiful racks of ribs. We've already showed you the beautiful Texas style brisket. Mm -hmm. We showed you the beautiful, pull. like, look, look, look at this. Even, even as we've been sitting here this whole time, oh look gosh. at how easy that is. It's literally shreddable oh. right on the grill. Oh, and by the way, I didn't even point these out today. These are bacon wrapped jalapeno poppers. Oh, wow. Now on any, any other grill, these would be catching on fire because <laughs> they're bacon wrapped. But because we have that indirect heat shield, you know, one of the great things, I love these things. These are great for parties and deliciousness. And that's just another part of the Traeger hood, right? So take a look at this. All right, we've got the ribs. I got, you know, I'm going to go right in there today. All right. Now oh take my. a look at this. Look at that. <laughs> Fall off the bone ribs. And, you know, everybody loves, look at that delicious meat. Look at how easy it came off the bone. Mm -hmm. I wanted to show you just how pretty these beautiful racks of ribs are. These bones can literally just tear right out of that meat. That meat is that succulent, that tender, and absolutely the most important thing, that absolutely delicious from the Traeger Grill and that hickory kiss goodness that, you know, that wood-fired all-natural pellet gives you. And that is barbecue delicious. Mm -hmm. And we didn't have to babysit this. We filled the hopper up, we put our meat on, we set the temperature, and the grill and the auger do all the work for us. Yes. It's delicious goodness. And, wow. and it is. And it, and it will be every time. And that's the thing. It's going to be consistent every time. To Danielle's point, you fill the hopper up. This is the hopper. 
and you pour in the wood pellets of which you are getting two 20 pound bags worth. One, wood, one is oak, one is hickory flavored. So you pour those pellets in there and then you close this, okay, you with me? You plug this in, maybe it would have already been plugged in, but it's a three prong plug, all right? That's done. You determine your temperature and you just turn, whether you wanna smoke, We've got from 180 and it goes all the way to 450. When you go to high, it's 450, okay? So you determine your temperature um, and then it will light up here. You put your food on and then you wait. And when it's done, you eat. And when it's time to clean up, this is your cleanup. You dump the bucket. <laughs> I mean, and then you want to wipe down the grill, of course. But I like that it's as simple as that. It doesn't have to be more involved. It doesn't have to be a whole big to-do because Traeger makes it easy. That's why so many people love it. That's why it's so popular. Danielle was sharing with you the fact that she is an expert. She is a master on the grill. She could use and has used any grill. She loves the Traeger. Danielle, did you say 20 of them you have? I have 22 of them. Tw <laughs> 22 of them. Every day. I can't even lie. <laughs> yes. Everybody has, you know, some women have shoes. I love barbecues, <laughs> specifically Traeger grills. I'm just saying, you know, um, here's the thing. I have the red, I have the black. I obviously have both of the colors as well. No joke. And because, you know what, why wouldn't you? Like, it, like for me, this is my life. This is my tool chest. And when you get delicious results like this every single day, whether it's a bacon and jalapeno popper, whether it's a rack of ribs, whether it's, you know, Texas style brisket, or even, you know, our holiday hams or a pie and a pizza, this is what makes my heart happy every mm -hmm. single day to be out here in the backyard creating and sharing recipes, you know, and making every day wood fire delicious and Traeger grills. And, you know, the reality is this, it's easy to use. It's super convenient. And, you know, I think this really does show, this is why I like to do four grills out here for everybody, to show the versatility, because this is what we actually do outside every day. This is the reality of, of why I own so many Traegers. You know, sometimes we're going into the fall season. I love putting a pot of beans on there or maybe mm. some chili. You know, we do the lasagna bakes out here. I make bolognese sauce on the grill. Wow. And then we go into the more delicate things. You know, we're coming up on the Christmas season. You know, maybe I'm going to do a little bit of meringue on the grill. Oh, I'm telling wow. you, there's so much versatility on all of these grills. And for me, once again, it just comes back to the flavor. You know, we showed you how moist and delicious and ugh, amazing all of these beautiful cuts of meat are. I mean, just right from the get-go, look at how succulent and moist that tomahawk is. It's been sitting out here now for 55 minutes. Mm -hmm. And look, that does not look dried out to me. I know that there's no way anybody would think of that as a beautiful, beautiful, look at that beautiful meat. It just, you know, this is the my real love of Traeger is because this is the results I get every day. Whether it's a chicken leg, whether it's salmon, or whether it's a, you know, amazing, amazing, delicious, gorgeous steak like this. This is the reality of how I actually cook every single day in my backyard. Yes. I mean, and, and I'll Good. tell you, I'll tell you this as you're watching and you're looking at that, that tomahawk wasn't free. That brisket wasn't no. free. <laughs> that I mean, this is the thing. We invest money. We spend money yep. in the foods that we eat, in the ingredients, in the meats that we bring in. So when you put it on your yeah. grill, you want to know that that grill is going to be able to handle that. And it does yep. beautifully every time. Um, and as you're watching, I want you to go ahead and get yours. You're going to get it in time for Labor Day weekend, which is coming up on September 6th. It's coming up before we know it. Literally, life is going by so fast. Why not have that amazing flavored, wood flavored food that we love all the time and definitely do it. I wanna, Danielle, I wanna just come back and say thank you so much for being with us. Thanks for all of the food that we could virtually eat. <laughs> <laughs> I, got, I got to. This was really hard today. I'm just saying. If you need me, I'm going to be eating the tomahawk next to the Traggers. I love it. Thank you so much. <laughs> we appreciate you so much, you and your entire crew there. Um, and you can go ahead and pick yours up. Do you want it in black or do you want it in the cinnamon red? Either way, we've got it for you. If you use any major credit card, you can get it on FlexPay for $118. If you use your HSN card, you can get it on FlexPay, like a 12-month FlexPay for $49. And that is with your 12-month VIP financing. Thanks for joining me in the kitchen, but we've got um, Alice coming up next. She's got some fall home essentials and she's gonna be, um, we're gonna take a look at some Samantha Brown. I'm Samantha Brown. 
and through my travels, I've learned that when function and form come together, the experience is effortless. That's why I've put together this collection of functional styles that will quickly become your go-tos for on the go. Whether you're running errands, spending the day at the park, or embarking on a road trip, my unique collection has you covered. Come join me as I discover more of the perfect pieces for your travels. Get the best deals on the things you love with the HSN card. As an HSN card VIP, you'll get all kinds of perks like extra flex or VIP financing on all items through September 30th. And at least eight VIP savings events a year includes fraud protection and there's no annual fee. Apply now and instantly get $10 off when you're approved. Call 1-800-695-1418 or visit hsn.com slash HSN card. Chef Curtis Stone has circled the globe in search of inspiring dishes. One of the top ten most magical things I've ever done in my life. And now you can cook along with him. Perfectly cooked steak makes me very happy. See where he goes, make what he makes, and do it all again. Perfecto. So many flavors, I can't even describe it. This is Travel Cook Repeat with Curtis Stone. Watch the series free on the QVC and HSN streaming service available on your streaming device. 15% off a future purchase? Then join HSN's email list. You'll receive a welcome coupon, plus so many special offers only for our email subscribers, like exclusive email-only invites to our private sales and events. Plus, you'll be first in line to shop our best values of the day and can't miss deals sent right